this is video two of Paint 3D, and this video is going to show you how to make some basic 3D shapes, and then we will be manipulating them and painting them and putting some stickers on them. Now if you go up to your menu, you're going to click on 3D shapes, and you have 3D models and then you have some 3D objects and you can also get more models here but for now let's just grab a fish and let's grab a color and you're just going to pull out the shape that you want. Now once you get this shape you're going to have four little icons here and these are really important. Now the one down here is going to rotate it back and forth and it will kind of snap at 90 degree angles. The one here will turn it around this way and the one here We'll turn it around. Now the one here is your 3D tool and this one will show you where your object is in perspective to the canvas. Now if I pull this out here you can tell I'm pretty far away from the canvas and if I start pulling it in here I'm actually pulling it behind the canvas. You can kind of see here it's on the other side so that is how you're going to line up your 3D objects. Now uh, you can also go up to the switch view. Now uh, you might have this in a different place. They, this is a new program so they kind of keep moving things around. But somewhere it should say something about the 3D view. And you're going to click this and if you use your mouse or your fingers on your screen, you'll be able to actually see the different perspectives of this. And then you can actually pull it away and change it. Now to go back, all you have to do is click off this view and you'll go back to this. Now if I click outside of this, I won't have it selected anymore. Uh, your select button is up here. Oh, it's been different places, but right now it's here. And if I have that selected, then I can select this. This blue line doesn't mean anything, and it's not going to print. All it's showing you is where the outline is. Okay, let's, uh, let's do some painting on this. And so let's kind of pull it around so that we can get to the... Uh, the eyes and I'm going to click on my brush tools and I'm just going to get a marker and I'm going to get a black marker and you can draw with either your pen or your mouse or you could even use your finger and you're going to make a little eye Now, you'll see just one icon down here. This will keep you in your paint tools while you spin it around. So what I can do is I can go here and I could uh, paint my uh, tail. Now keep in mind when you're painting that I'm only painting one side of this and I'm using my mouse so it's going a little bit slow. So I would need to turn this around if I want to get the other side. Let me get a bigger paintbrush. So we can kind of see how that works and you can spin it around. Now once you get it all painted the way you like 
if you click this button right here, it'll just take you back to where you started. And then if I click my Select Tools 3D Shape, I'll, I can click here and pull it back. So you can draw on this 3D shape. Uh, you can also put stickers. So if I click stickers, and you have a number of different stickers, and eventually they'll be putting other ones. And there's also different textures you can put on, and then you can go and you can add more. Let's just click on this one. Now, once you start drawing on here, do you see how that sticker kind of wraps around? And if I pull it around here, I can pull this the way I like. Now, once I like where it is, I'm going to click on, it's kind of like your commit button. And so you can see that there is the sticker. Now, that is part of the fish now. And the only way you can get rid of that is just to go up and undo it and uh, put it in there again. So that is your sticker. So I'll spend a little bit of time uh, opening up different 3D shapes and using some of your brushes with it and trying various stickers.